Welcome to an overview of Spravato Esketamine Nasal Spray C3. Spravato is a prescription medicine taken along with an oral antidepressant for treatment-resistant depression in adults. Spravato is not for use as a medicine to prevent or relieve pain, anesthetic. It is not known if Spravato is safe and effective as an anesthetic medicine. It is not known if Spravato is safe and effective for use in preventing suicide or in reducing suicidal thoughts or actions. Spravato is not for use in place of hospitalization if your healthcare provider determines that hospitalization is needed, even if improvement is experienced after the first dose of Spravato. It is not known if Spravato is safe and effective in children. You may want to talk to your healthcare provider about Spravato if you've been struggling with treatment-resistant depression and are ready to discuss a different option that may work for you. Before prescribing Spravato, your healthcare provider will review your medical history, discuss safety information, and answer your questions. Spravato can cause serious side effects, including sedation and dissociation. There is a risk for abuse with Spravato. Be sure to tell your healthcare provider if you have a history of abusing prescription or street drugs or a problem with alcohol. Because of these risks, Spravato can only be administered at healthcare settings certified in the Spravato Risk Evaluation and Mitigation Strategy, REMS, program. There is an increased risk of suicidal thoughts and behavior with Spravato. Call your healthcare provider right away if you have new or sudden changes in mood, behavior, thoughts, or feelings. If you and your healthcare provider decide that Spravato could be part of your overall treatment plan, here's an overview of what to expect. Spravato is given at certified Spravato treatment centers, and you and your healthcare provider can choose a location. Your first visit to the certified Spravato treatment center will be a consultation. A healthcare provider will discuss your medical history, schedule appointments, check your insurance, and map out your Spravato treatment plan. At outpatient settings, your healthcare provider will enroll you in the Spravato REMS to keep track of serious side effects you may experience, including sedation or dissociation. Then, on your next visit, you can start treatment with Spravato. You'll learn more about administration on the day of your treatment. On treatment days, you'll take Spravato nasal spray yourself, under the supervision of a healthcare provider. After administering your dose, you may want to listen to music, read, or just relax while a healthcare provider monitors you for at least two hours to check for possible side effects, like increased blood pressure. Other serious side effects include problems with thinking clearly and bladder problems. See the most common side effects on screen below. After the observation period, when your healthcare provider gives you the okay, you'll be ready to leave. Keep in mind, you won't be able to drive or operate machinery until the next day after a restful sleep. So you'll need to plan for rides on treatment days. You'll take Spravato twice a week for the first month. During the second month, you'll take Spravato once a week. After that, Spravato is usually taken once a week or once every two weeks. Be sure to share your progress with your healthcare provider who will remain an important part of your care. Are you ready to talk to your doctor about Spravato? Discuss the facts and decide together if Spravato could be part of your overall treatment plan. Please listen to the following important safety information in this video. What is Spravato, Esketamine, C3 nasal spray? Spravato is a prescription medicine used along with an antidepressant taken by mouth to treat adults with treatment-resistant depression, TRD. Spravato is not for use as a medicine to prevent or relieve pain, anesthetic. It is not known if Spravato is safe or effective as an anesthetic medicine. It is not known if Spravato is safe and effective for use in preventing suicide or in reducing suicidal thoughts or actions. Spravato is not for use in place of hospitalization if your healthcare provider determines that hospitalization is needed, even if improvement is experienced after the first dose of Spravato. It is not known if Spravato is safe and effective in children. Important safety information. What is the most important information I should know about Spravato? Spravato can cause serious side effects, including sedation and dissociation. Spravato may cause sleepiness, sedation, fainting, dizziness, spinning sensation, anxiety, or feeling disconnected from yourself, your thoughts, feelings, space, and time dissociation. 
Tell your healthcare provider right away if you feel like you cannot stay awake or if you feel like you are going to pass out. Your healthcare provider must monitor you for serious side effects for at least two hours after taking Spravato. Your healthcare provider will decide when you are ready to leave the healthcare setting. Abuse and misuse. There is a risk for abuse and physical and psychological dependence with Spravato treatment. Your healthcare provider should check you for signs of abuse and dependence before and during treatment with Spravato. Tell your healthcare provider if you have ever abused or been dependent on alcohol, prescription medicines, or street drugs. Your healthcare provider can tell you more about the differences between physical and psychological dependence and drug addiction. Spravato Risk Evaluation and Mitigation Strategy, REMS. Because of the risks for sedation, dissociation, and abuse and misuse, Spravato is only available through a restricted program called the Spravato Risk Evaluation and Mitigation Strategy, REMS, program. Spravato can only be administered at healthcare settings certified in the Spravato REMS program. Patients treated in outpatient healthcare settings, for example, medical offices and clinics, must be enrolled in the program. Increased risk of suicidal thoughts and actions. Antidepressant medicines may increase suicidal thoughts and actions in some people 24 years of age and younger, especially within the first few months of treatment or when the dose is changed. Spravato is not for use in children. Depression and other serious mental illnesses are the most important causes of suicidal thoughts and actions. Some people may have a higher risk of having suicidal thoughts or actions. These include people who have, or have a family history of, depression or a history of suicidal thoughts or actions. How can I watch for and try to prevent suicidal thoughts and actions in myself or a family member? Pay close attention to any changes, especially sudden changes in mood, behavior, thoughts, or feelings, or if you develop suicidal thoughts or actions. Tell your healthcare provider right away if you have any new or sudden changes in mood, behavior, thoughts, or feelings. Keep all follow-up visits with your healthcare provider as scheduled. Call your healthcare provider between visits as needed, especially if you have concerns about symptoms. Tell your healthcare provider right away if you or your family member have any of the following symptoms, especially if they are new, worse, or worry you. Suicide attempts. Thoughts about suicide or dying. Worsening depression. Other unusual changes in behavior or mood. Do not take Spravato if you have blood vessel, aneurysmal vascular, disease, including the brain, chest, abdominal aorta, arms, and legs. Have an abnormal connection between your veins and arteries, arteriovenous malformation. Have a history of bleeding in the brain. Are allergic to esketamine, ketamine, or any of the other ingredients in Spravato. If you are not sure if you have any of the above conditions, Talk to your healthcare provider before taking Spravato. Before you take Spravato, tell your healthcare provider about all of your medical conditions, including if you have heart or brain problems, including high blood pressure, hypertension, slow or fast heartbeats that cause shortness of breath, chest pain, lightheadedness, or fainting, history of heart attack, history of stroke, heart valve disease or heart failure, history of brain injury or any condition where there is increased pressure in the brain, have liver problems, have ever had a condition called psychosis, see, feel, or hear things that are not there or believe in things that are not true, are pregnant or plan to become pregnant. Spravato may harm your baby. You should not take Spravato if you are pregnant. Tell your healthcare provider right away if you become pregnant during treatment with Spravato. If you are able to become pregnant, talk to your healthcare provider about methods to prevent pregnancy during treatment with Spravato. There is a pregnancy registry for women who are exposed to Spravato during pregnancy. The purpose of the registry is to collect information about the health of women exposed to Spravato and their baby. If you become pregnant during treatment with Spravato, talk to your healthcare provider about registering with the National Pregnancy Registry for Antidepressants at 1-844-405-6185 or online at https colon forward slash forward slash womensmentalhealth.org forward slash clinical dash and dash research 
dash programs forward slash pregnancy registry forward slash antidepressants forward slash. Are breastfeeding or plan to breastfeed? You should not breastfeed during treatment with Spravato. Tell your healthcare provider about all the medicines that you take, including prescription and over the counter medicines, vitamins, and herbal supplements. Taking Spravato with certain medicine may cause side effects. Especially tell your healthcare provider if you take central nervous system, CNS, depressants, psychostimulants, or monoamine oxidase inhibitors, MAOIs, medicines. Keep a list of them to show to your healthcare provider and pharmacist when you get a new medicine. How will I take Spravato? You will take Spravato nasal spray yourself under the supervision of a healthcare provider in a healthcare setting. Your healthcare provider will show you how to use the Spravato nasal spray device. Your healthcare provider will tell you how much Spravato you will take and when you will take it. Follow your Spravato treatment schedule exactly as your healthcare provider tells you to. During and after each use of the Spravato nasal spray device, you will be checked by a healthcare provider who will decide when you are ready to leave the healthcare setting. You will need to plan for a caregiver or family member to drive you home after taking Spravato. If you miss a Spravato treatment, your healthcare provider may change your dose and treatment schedule. Some people taking Spravato get nausea and vomiting. You should not eat for at least two hours before taking Spravato and not drink liquids at least 30 minutes before taking Spravato. If you take a nasal corticosteroid or nasal decongestant medicine, take these medicines at least one hour before taking Spravato. What should I avoid while taking Spravato? Do not drive, operate machinery, or do anything where you need to be completely alert after taking Spravato. Do not take part in these activities until the next day following a restful sleep. See what is the most important information I should know about Spravato. What are the possible side effects of Spravato? Spravato may cause serious side effects, including See what is the most important information I should know about Spravato. Increased blood pressure. Spravato can cause a temporary increase in your blood pressure that may last for about four hours after taking a dose. Your healthcare provider will check your blood pressure before taking Spravato and for at least two hours after you take Spravato. Tell your healthcare provider right away if you get chest pain, shortness of breath, sudden severe headache, change in vision, or seizures after taking Spravato. Problems with thinking clearly. Tell your healthcare provider if you have problems thinking or remembering. Bladder problems. Tell your healthcare provider if you develop trouble urinating, such as a frequent or urgent need to urinate, pain when urinating, or urinating frequently at night. The most common side effects of Spravato when used along with an antidepressant taken by mouth include feeling disconnected from yourself, your thoughts, feelings, and things around you, dizziness, nausea, feeling sleepy, spinning sensation, decreased feeling of sensitivity, numbness, feeling anxious, lack of energy, increased blood pressure, vomiting, feeling drunk, feeling very happy or excited. If these common side effects occur, they usually happen right after taking Spravato and go away the same day. These are not all the possible side effects of Spravato. Call your doctor for medical advice about side effects. You may report side effects to FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088. Please see full prescribing information, including boxed warnings and medication guide for Spravato at spravato.com and discuss any questions you may have with your healthcare provider.